All right, all right. They need a break. We'll halt the caravan. I guess. I guess. <sighs> we do have to level people up, though. Mogra leans on a fallen tree, filling with a crust of bread. I'm getting colder, he says, staring into the distance. You can see Ridgehorn just start to peek around the mountains. A flock of ravens float across a clear sky toward the fort. We should follow those birds. Huh. Why? What's up, buddy? <gasps> what? Got another word. Mogra starts running toward the birds and tumbles over the cliff. Suddenly he's gliding through the air, flapping his arms for all they're worth. He swoops toward Ridgehorn before bursting into flames and plummeting into the tower, which crumbles like a log from a smoldering So you were dreaming? What? <laughs> yep. Yep, yep. You think you've lost your mind. Then you wake up. <laughs> you don't remember setting up camp or falling asleep. What's going on, you muttered? Mogur approaches you at the campfire. Hoken, did you see? He starts. Yeah, you both agree to keep it to yourselves. I think that's why. Let's level up our heroes while we're here. And then we're gonna rest. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Promote. Uh, let's see what else we have real quick before we... I think you can just close on the little X uh, next to promote. I, can, uh, I cannot see anything. Do you want me to click? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Eye fatigue, kids. It's a thing. Vision fatigue? Eye fatigue? Either way. I don't know. Definitely gotta promote Chris. Yeah, yeah. That was a good call. And... What are it? Oh, yeah. We're just... For sure. Nice. When it's so close, we're gonna promote you. Yeah, Ganolf could really use it. Up your yeah. insertion... Let's get you some more armor. I think. Yeah, especially if we're gonna try to get him to be the like, come hit me. Come hit me, bro. Come hit me, bro. Alright, we can totally promote him then. Sweet. Uh, yup. Alright. Mm, let's go ahead and max out all the armor and let's go ahead and max yeah. out the armor break while we're here. Cool. Excellent. So that's done. Uh, nope. And nope, don't care about any of you. That's not necessarily true. I do care about you. I mean it. Uh, let's just yeah, yeah. rest for one more. One more. Yeah. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, morale's better. Oh, much better. Let's go. Sweet. No more creepy dreams. Dad. No more jumping off clips after birds. Please no. There's some weird stuff in this game sometimes. I'm sure you've seen them, Moger says, but we're being followed. Dredge have been on our asses since we left the Godstone. Lots of them. I'm sure there's plenty in front of us, too, but we're just half a day out from thick woods. We might lose them there. Stop and get ready when ready for a fight. More slacks to kill, or we'll lose them. We'll lose them? In the woods? Let's try. The Varl don't enjoy shuffling through undergrowth, but the Dredge hate it even more. Most stop at the edge of the forest, and the ones who follow are picked off without much effort. They begin to creep around the tree line, and you hope you can outpace them to the other side. Ooh. Run, 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 run! Go, guys, go! Please, oh, please, oh, please. Let's not get trapped. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be good to not do that. Deep inside the woods, you get the distinct sense that Dredge have more or less surrounded you. Oh, good. And in great numbers. Yay, we made choices. The dark shapes create unsettling patterns as they slide between the trees in every direction. Come look around. <laughs> Any ideas? Wait them out. Ask Moger's advice. I, I'd ask advice. I'm worried if we wait anymore, it'll... <laughs> yeah, pray to whatever god you like. There's more than waiting on the other side of the woods than we've seen so far. We may be seriously outnumbered, especially if we wait. Alright, no waiting. Glad we're not waiting. You're so pure as I expected to be. What if... You could set part of the woods on fire to draw their attention while you escape or try to draw them into a trap. Let's do that. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> draw them into the woods and set them on fire. Right! Create a line of shield bangers and unleash volleys of arrows in their direction, luring frustrated swaths of them into the trees. At your command, Yursa flings flaming arrows into key locations. The trees erupt and fire spreads quickly. Many fall immediately, but the Varls start to lose their nerve. Soon the caravan is in disarray, some fighting, others fleeing from the growing inferno. 
Your slaves have vanished. Loot and rushes past in a state of terror. You break from trees, hoping to regroup. Whoops. Oh. Oh God no! God damn it. Where is Yursa? Behind you, Varl are following your lead, though not as many as you had hoped. The dredge, distracted by the fire, had thankfully not yet noticed your escape. Isn't she with you? Don't. Did you make her do it? Where is she? I didn't make her do anything. It was her idea. Ludin stares into the flames, face blank. He's trying to hard not to show what this means to him. A miserable moment lingers. Did she die? We've got to get out of here, Hogan. We bought minutes at the most. Did she die or did she use this as a way to get out? I she don't didn't... know. We don't know that she's gone anyway. Maybe she'll catch up to us. Mogur gathers the others. Someone drags Ludin along against his will, but you hear no outbursts or insults. It's almost worse that way. Aw, oh, buddy, we broke your spirit. Oh. Too bad I don't feel that we're guilty. Okay. We lost... Well, I don't know if we would have lost more or less fighting. Ooh. There's the tower, man. Oh, that looks so sick. Lightning in the distance. Fire at the disco. <laughs> Always that. Every time. Are we here yet? Are we here yet? I think we might be. The map's not panning anymore. Yeah. We made it! Sweet bridges. That is quite the precarious bridge. All the dredge in the foreground. So we've got quite a few battles under our belt now. What are you... How are you feeling about the fight system and our characters' abilities and all that other good stuff? So far, so good. Definitely getting the hang of them. I think fitting parties together is probably one of the most fun and strategic things you could do? Um, you mean in terms of like how when you have them go and where you place them trying to keep yeah. all that kind of stuff in mind? Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, when, whose abilities complement each other's definitely. stuff like that. That is one thing that I've noticed is that uh, nobody's abilities really chain together. Mm -hmm. um, it's either you have one really solid ability or the other. And they work pretty independently of each other. It's not like you can have three characters and just use all their abilities in a row and have a really good combo. Right. Which is fine. Um, but that's... Actually, I think that's one of the things that I really dislike in a lot of games is having that, that like, I have to have this combo go off, otherwise everything goes to shit. Right. Having everybody be kind of their own person and able to handle their stuff on their own. It's nice. Narratively so speaking, strange. the march into this city was sad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what is this mess about? Looks like a full-scale battle happened, and recently. But only dredge bodies remain. Maybe we'll see something from the tower. Have Varl search the buildings and make sure there's no dredge waiting to spring on us. On it. And don't set up camp or make a fire. We'll take a look and then get out of here before anything else goes wrong. You mean more wrong. Fuck you. He's sad. He lost his witch lady. Alright, heroes. We're good there. Yeah. I just double checked on all of them, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. To the tower. To the tower. Dun dun. Da da dun dun. Da da dun dun. Da da dun. Oh, oh. We're getting Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, let's just leave this the way it is. Let's try and get more people other than just Hogan to murder. I know we're really close with... Hold on, who are we close with? Let's let's see what we're yeah, looking yeah. at here. So used to right-clicking because of Darkest Dungeon. <laughs> All right, he needs two. We're going to try and not have... Well, I mean, we can always just do it. But two. two only one. one. Just one. Just one. Okay. All right. So... Everybody's just really close to yeah. leveling up. So anyway, we slice it, we'll be happy. But we definitely need to get a kill with Sure enough, some dredge. Of course. Oh, gotta get back this on. battlefield. I hate this. I hate everything about this already. Some people. Alright, you're going first. 
on you. And gross. I'm gonna have yeah. Sal come over here. Same with Eric. We should have someone go around the hole to get that one slinger guy that's hanging out. You think so? Yeah. Who do you think is probably gonna be the best at that? Maybe Ganolf? Probably. Or Hogan, because he... Eh, probably Hogan, actually. He stands the best chance on his own. Okay, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, put him all the way that way so he can just go up and over and get out of there fast. Yep. okay. All right, let's hope that works out. And then he can go around and flank, too. Yep. After he kills that so guy. Let's just put him right there. Okay, cool. Okay, here we go. I can't kill anybody with that, so... If I bring him all the way up here, I'm not going to be able to get around with Gris or Ganolf, and then Fasalt's going to get stuck. I don't think you need to go all the way up there. I think they'll come to you. I'm just gonna go all the way up. Yeah, go for Might it. Might as well. Not quite. All right. Might as well. If I do that, then I won't be able to get around with the salt. If I go all the way up here, then Mogro gets stuck behind me. But. What do you think? I would bring him not up to the shield guy yeah over there. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, he's not going to pass through any enemies, but that'll def but that'll it'll clear up some space and he can yep. pursue them and make some room. There we go. Halfway down. Well, I guess you can bring hacking around him now. Mm-hmm. I can't go through there. I bring him, yeah, left, especially if we end up moving hacking around the other here. guy. Yeah. Um, maybe to Hoken because we used a bunch like three stars. I think you're right. To move him. Yeah, he's only got two. Excellent. Yeah. I think the benefit of having two people playing this game is that one person, who's ever controlling the mouse is really focused on everything and yes. the other person is like the eyes. It's like, no, but wait, like, let's look at the big picture here. Come yeah. <laughs> I didn't notice that until we switched who had yep. the mouse, but that makes a lot of sense. Oh yeah, most definitely. And it'll hurt our guy too. I think that's showing that I can use, I can have him be a target. Mm. for this. Um, do you want to knock him out of the way? or Because then that way he can't use his ability as soon as yeah. he goes. Yeah. Cool. I like that. Back yep. already. And now he's back. And he can't use his ability. That's really good. He's only got eight armor left. That's not too bad. Let's just yeah. move up. Oh yeah, good. Take that guy out. Yep. Promote! Our promotion Beautiful. He's just not able to get in there. I wonder, do you think going around the hole would be better? I, I feel like that might just take even longer. I know. We just need to push them back so we have more space. Is really... I think once we get Ganolf up through this way... Yeah. Because once I move him up that way, then he'll be able to come through. So maybe, maybe just, I just move, move him, him in the up. middle. I'm just gonna move him yeah. Right and even just use that little star so that it'll be a little bit. Okay. All right. Awkward battlefield. Truth. 
Oh, those freaking shards. Yup. Fucking hate those. Now, is it if you pass over them? I think so. Or it might be a timed? It might be. Huh. Yeah, I don't remember now. Ew. Yep. Take it away, Gris. Then we can use battering ram again. Mm -hmm. Oh good, yeah, move him over so we can get the... the other guy through. If I go up there, then I won't be able to do anything to anybody. I can only do something if I go here, but then if I go that, yeah, that might just be, that might still just be worth it. Just yeah. to get him out of the way. Yeah, he doesn't need to level up anyway. It's true. Or we're trying to get some of the people who only have one Actually, kill. Actually, we are, yes. He needs two. Yeah, so yeah. There. Stupid freaking crack in the ground. <laughs> I just want to make sure that I'm not crazy. There's no enemies up here. Thank goodness. Yeah. Yep, oh, okay, up. time. And there goes Canal. Well, I mean, at least we can get around now. There we yeah. Go. If I go there, then I'll be able to bring Moger around the next time. On yeah. The side. Okay. I think that's good. And then we can have um, the salt do that in area. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, get some action for him. I'm gonna Chill. have him break. Yeah. Malice. Come here. <laughs> Come at me. I mean, oh golly gee. <laughs> Alright, who needs it? You needs it, you needs it. All, all needs it. <laughs> they Come all here. needs it. Hmm, who's more likely you know to what? use it? We're trying to get Hoken back up here, so I'm okay. gonna go ahead and give it to him. Sounds good. Yeah. Yeah. Or do we want to spend all of his willpower and bring him up? I don't know. I wouldn't. Oh yeah, I'd just do him there. Okay. He's getting pretty close at this point. Moker's down. Man. This terrain or this battlefield setup has definitely been brutal. Right, well what are you supposed- Because I think what they were counting on is that you would just ignore that little dude and so he'd just be able to pick off and we... Opted not to do that. No. no. You think malice? I would just hit some uh, attacks. Or just regular attack? Yeah. Add some. Uh... Yeah. Yeah. They won't do quite as much damage. He has none, he has none. Two. You have two. Who's, Fasult's gonna go, oh no. Gris will go for it next. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go to Gris then. Cool. Can't, still can't reach. <sighs> so close. <sighs> Crackerjack, all right. Maybe I'll draw some fire. Let's hope. Yeah. Those stupid things. Maybe, like, move him right over. Yeah. Take that one throwy guy out. With a four. Or halfway, at least. No, that's not gonna work. Yeah, I just get him. Yep.
All right. Oh, good. Yeah, do that. So glad we gave. Oh, we didn't give him the willpower. Oh well. Yep. How are we to know? It's still gonna. He's still not gonna be able to do very much damage now. And Gris is down. Man, this is a brutal fight. Let's just have him come up and finish him. Yeah. Agreed. Good. And now he gets promoted! And now he explodes. He's... Oh, he's still okay, though. Alright, let's finish this. Yep. <laughs> Overkill. By a okay. lot. Oh my god. Promoted, though. Yeah. That's because he killed one of them, this guy. Closing in on you, dude. All right, beautiful. And Bye. And we're done. Woo. That was, that was nice. a rough battle. <sighs> At least we got a lot of promotions. I think all of them that we were thinking about. Uh, we got three. We missed off uh, out on Moger and Gris. Yeah. Or Fasalt, I think. Either way. You lean on a crumpled wall, watching endless waves of dredge marching below. Satisfied, Hakon Moger asks, The vast number of dredge remind you of the Great Wars. I've seen enough, you reply. Let's get out of here. Wow. Moger stands over the bodies of the man and woman. Think the slag came up here for those two? Asks Moger, waving his bloody weapon in their direction. Why would anyone be here? Any idea who they are? Or search them? If we search them, we might have an idea of who they are. Or do we try and show respect for the... Mm, what do you think? Search them. I just want to figure out who they are. Let's see who it is. Moger leans down, painting the man's tunic. He stops, friends, and presses the ear against the man's chest. This one's breathing, he says, pulling the man upright. She wasn't so lucky. Yeah. Playing a metal reaches you from the courtyard below, muffled by the thick snow. You curse. Quick, back down. Bring the live one. You skip stairs as you descend, shouting orders to the varl below. Oh no. But we ah, it's gonna have to be next time. Yep, we'll fight oh, later. Man. <laughs>